Hey guys, um, today I want to talk about something kind of serious, uh, something that happened in the past. Sorry, let me shut this window. This cold air is making me anxious and it's triggering memories. Um, so I used to have this pretty good relationship with um, a fan and this fan actually ended up really betraying me. This fan would make me feel comfortable, like I'd go to it to feel comfortable under like extreme situations. And I kind of blame myself. I told myself not to be too trusting with fans and don't put yourself in a position where you can be betrayed. I was really drawn by the loyalty I was shown by this fan and I ended up really fucked up. My summer was pretty much ruined. It was the start of summer and it really fucked me up. Very slowly I've been able to trust more and more fans um, and I'm able to be surrounded by them again. It's still really hard to talk about but I guess all I can say is that's what the fan has done to me. Seriously, look. Can you see that scar? The fan nearly took my finger right off. Damn. Um, yeah, I was reaching over to get my Game Boy back then. I was about eight. And I guess the fan was open a bit. You know, one of those um, kind of old fashioned now mini metal fans. Well, I picked up my Game Boy and I thought everything was okay. But then I looked down and I was bleeding. Then I showed my mom and she asked me, how did that happen? And I said, the fan. And I didn't realize it was that serious. But then she took a closer look and she almost tore my finger off because it was already hanging off, but she didn't know either. And then my finger was hanging down and then we just looked at each other and I think I screamed and panicked. And then we had to drive to the hospital and I was in my underwear because I was swimming in the pool all day. And I was kind of chubby back then and I was a bit um, embarrassed about my uh, blubber on my stomach. But I had to get stitches, go straight to the emergency room and um, get stitched up with my uh, eight-year-old cock. Nearly hanging out. But yeah, that was how I was too trusting with a fan. If you take anything from this video, just uh, be careful around fans. I've had a bad experience and um, I am slowly learning to trust fans again, but I don't really have to worry about it these days since I do have an air conditioner in my house. Yeah, they're a lot cooler. So yeah, don't trust fans. Oh, this new crazy mother.